Hello everybody. Happy Sunday. Hope you all had a great day. We had a really good day. Um, I made lunch for everybody and then we went for a nice long drive, went to the beach. Um, the waves were amazing guys, amazing. So I got out, I walked around, I took some pictures and some videos and posted them on my page. It was so nice to get like fresh air, like just that cold, fresh air. So good. All right, guys, I wanted to come on because honestly, I am tired of sitting at my computer and I wanted to take today really just to relax and I didn't hold myself to any schedule. I figured if I wanted to come on and film, I would film. If I didn't, I didn't. It wasn't, I wasn't going to hold myself to anything. So we got home, sat down, but then I was like, you know what? I think we're going to go do a makeup look. And as I was looking over all the palettes, I'm like, I want to do something fun, like just fun, like that maybe I would never wear on a normal basis, but just to do something different and something fun. So that's what we're going to do today. And it's already 530. So I'm going to put this on. It's going to come right off, but that's okay. No worries. It's still fun. So I already have my primer on guys, okay? And we're gonna go in with our VFX Pro Camera Ready Foundation. And currently I am using the shade 04. There is another shade that I think I'm going to also try and see um, what that looks like. But so far I'm rather impressed with the shade that I picked. It has a little bit of a pinky undertone to it so i like it it's not a lot of times the shades that i go with always seem to be more orangey under like undertone to them and i more of pink undertone so this works out great and my beauty blender is damp so I am just going to go in and start putting this on. Actually, let me spray a little bit of, it's not as damp as I thought it was. Let me just go in and spray it a little bit. Now this guys is a full coverage foundation and it's long lasting. So if you want a full coverage, long lasting foundation, this would be the way to go. And I just got makeup all over my little earrings. I love these earrings, they're so cute and fun. They're like little lips. I like them. It's a little bit of a fun little pair of earrings. Okay. So I'm just going to put a little bit more on the areas that I need it. Put some on the, over my lip. And like I said, guys, this is a really full, full coverage foundation. So if that's what you're looking for, you can hop on over to my website and grab that if you want. Especially if you were someone that was used to using the um, liquid serum like I was because it's been mm -hmm. retired. I had to switch um, foundations, but I think you guys will like it. And if you find it to be a little too um, drying for you, which so far I haven't found that with me and I have very dry skin, you can add a little bit of serum to it and that will help. Um, I was doing that and I had no problems, but then the last couple of times I've used no serum, just the foundation and it's been great. You can see it doesn't look dry. It looks really pretty. So I'm I'm happy with it. I'm happy with it. So now I'm gonna go in with 01 Cool Light Pressed Powder to set my eyes. As always. 
and then we are going to do something really really fun we're going to do a fun purple look okay and this is going to be like oh my god like 80s type fun like purple 80 times don't oh my god i'm gonna have dust and powder everywhere powder powder particles everywhere oh lordy okay so we're gonna use the wonderlust palette today guys this is what it looks like ain't she pretty oh that made my lighting go crazy um i am going to use two colors mainly i'm going to use divine and cupcake so divine and cupcake and I'm going to use Divine in the crease. And we're going to see what that does for us. And I am going to put my mirror here. And I'm going to put that color Divine in the crease. It's a really pretty dark um, purple. Super, super pretty. because we're gonna go pretty bright on the lid. And I didn't want the whole eye to be too, too bright. So we're gonna have this as our ground. So I'm putting that in the crease. I have my glass, my big, big, big cup of water. Um, trying to stay on track today guys i made the best breakfast oh my god i used a um low carb wrap like a tortilla wrap and i did a little slit in it and then i used a egg white you know you can get the frozen egg whites i used one of those i put a slice of Velveeta cheese on top of that and i put it in the microwave to warm it then I threw the tortilla in the microwave for a second to warm it. And I did two slices. You can have bacon. It Bacon's really low point. So I had two slices of the microwavable bacon. I put that in the microwave. And then you fold it almost like a crunch wrap style. And oh my God, guys, it was so good so good and the whole thing and it was huge like huge I couldn't even finish it the whole thing was like I think came out to six points for the entire sandwich it was incredible and it was amazing it was so so good I love it I'm like can't wait to have it again tomorrow and it filled me for hours like I felt full for so long and just having the egg white, I didn't miss not having the whole egg. Just having that egg white was good. So that was zero points. The Velveeta slice is one point or one bite. Um, and then the wrap was four. I think it was two or four points. And the bacon was two points. For two slices and I could not be happier I just oh my god so good all right I'm gonna go on with cupcake on the lid so I I felt totally satisfied and full for the for the most of part of the day um yeah I was rather happy rather happy with it isn't that pretty guys that's the color cupcake it's so so pretty it's subtle but it shows up just enough like so that it's not like too much I love it. And I love purples on blue eyes, green eyes. They're just so pretty. 
it's so pretty. So, and I'm using my finger because I find that it sticks a little bit better when I use my finger. This color can be really sheer if you don't use your finger. At least on my eyelids, I find that it can be almost too sheer. Okay, let me get a wipe. I just finally got a new supply of our Pharmacy Scentsy Wipes. These things are amazing, guys. Oh my God, if you don't have our wipes, you need to get some. They're so good. And let's just make sure that there's no fallout. All right, and now what I'm going to do is I am going to go underneath my eye, um, my brow bone with the color base from that same um, palette. And I'm just putting that underneath. So guys, what did you all do today? What did you all do today? Anything good? I think some people have a long weekend. I think you guys might have a long weekend. I know we do. I mean, I can always have a long weekend because I'm lucky enough to make my own schedule, but not everybody is lucky like that. Let me fix my, I feel like I, <laughs> being choked. So I washed my hair last night, guys, and I dried it. And I've come to the conclusion I do not like my hair curly anymore at all. Just don't like it. All right, I am going to go in with some blush. And I am going to use, let's see. Nope, I can never find it. If it was the one that I want, didn't want, it would be right at the top. But because, because it's the one I want. Okay, so this is number 16 but this one is retired i believe so i apologize but i love this blush color with this eye look i'm gonna place that on and then i'm just going to go in and blend that out i don't put a lot of blush guys you know the drill i don't like a lot of blush but you can put as much as you want. It's really a pretty, pretty color. Very pretty. Okay, now I am going to take a little brush and we're gonna go underneath and See if the cupcake's going to show up underneath. Hmm, not really. Let's go in with a little bit of the divine. Yeah, that's better. Much better. That's pretty. Okay, so then I'm going to go in with the color Princess. I love this color. It's so pretty. And I'm going to pop that in the inner corner. And again, guys, like I said, this is going to be more of like a bolder 
eye look a little bit brighter okay so we have princess in the inner corner and i'm just going to make sure that we have no fallout make sure that's all good okay eyes are done so now we're going to go in with a little bit of highlight and i am going to use a little bit of the terracotta blush in the shade 05 and i'm going to use that for my um highlight so i'm going to just go in and use that as the highlight today because it's super pretty see how pretty that is it's, yeah, it's so good okay so Number five, terracotta blush. Boy, there's just powder everywhere. It looks like it's snowing. It's kind of pretty in a way. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to go in and I am going to use some... This is just a dewy makeup spray. I'm going to put this on before I put my mascara. Sheesh. Let that dry for a minute. Guys, I used the new um, Age Reversed uh, Beauty Mask last night. Oh my God, guys, when I got up this morning, my face felt like a newborn's baby's butt. So, so good. Oh, oh my God. It felt so good when I woke up this morning. My skin was so hydrated. It was great. It was great. I do not like my hair like this. I feel weird. I feel like I have a palm tree sticking out of my head. But I don't have anything to wrap it with, so let's see if I can just tuck it, because I really don't like it. It's bothering me. Let's see if I can just tuck it. Probably not. You guys ever, like, do your hair one way and then it just is not at all like you wanted it to be but you're just too lazy to fix it that's kind of how i was and i used a different leave-in and i'm not thrilled with it not too thrilled with it okay that's a little bit better than the palm tree look that was not attractive all right, so now I am going to put some mascara on and we're gonna use the vegan green mascara, not green in color, green because it's vegan. I love this mascara, guys. Oh my God, I love it so much. It is so good. The brush is like amazing. It's just, it gives you length, it gives you volume. I love everything about it. The wand. So even if you are not vegan, go get this mascara. It is an amazing, like, everyday mascara. And it feels so, like, good on your lashes. And so lightweight. Like, it doesn't feel like anything at all. It doesn't get, like, clumpy. It doesn't feel drying. Like, my lashes feel hydrated when I put it on. It's weird. I'm really, really liking it. Look at, that. Look at that, guys. Can you see the difference? What a huge difference. 
one coat makes. That's insane. I love this. I mean, I love our double lash extend. I've worn that so much now. And then of course I have my favorites. My star look, my deep black and my optimal. But I have to say, I used optimal as my everyday mascara. Like if I was just gonna be around the house, and I just wanted to pop something on, I would use Optimal. But guys, this one, I think I like better than Optimal. I don't know, it just, I can't even explain to you. It just, yeah, lashes feel so hydrated. Not wet, just you know, like, they feel really good. I don't know how else to explain it. They just feel so good. And it's buildable, which I love because some mascaras dry so fast that you can't go in for a second coat if you want to. And not that I usually do, but I like to have the option if I want to. And some mascaras, you just can't. As I almost poke my eye out. I've been using our lash and brow serum because my, I don't know, my lashes have been wanting to go the opposite direction of what they should be. So I'm trying to use that and like retrain them to go the way they should go. Like this eye, the lashes want to come down this way instead of going that way. So I'm hoping I can retrain them to go the way they're supposed to. And then on this eye, these want to go this way. <laughs> but like, the, instead of the corner ones going the way they should, they want to go the opposite way. It's, it's insane. But let me do my lower lashes. Let me get the mirror. So I do not make a mess. We're gonna use a really fun, bright lipstick today. Really bright lipstick. <laughs> That's why I say I don't think I would wear this look every day with this lipstick, but it's definitely fun. Definitely fun, and everyone needs fun. It's Sunday. What better day to do a fun makeup look than a Sunday? Because I don't know about you guys, but I'm not into football or sports, to be honest. I don't like any sports. Never have, never will. Just never got into any sports. Hockey, baseball, football, soccer, nothing. All right, guys, look at that. Is that not gorgeous looking lashes? All thanks to the vegan mascara. That's so good. It's so, so good. I look up for you guys, hold on. I always get dizzy when I try to do this. Can you guys see? <laughs> so pretty, it's so pretty. Oh guys, I can't wait to drop this weight again. I feel like a big, big beached whale. I really do. I, oh God. I feel like my face is huge.
humongous. That's what I feel like. I just feel like my face is so, so big again because it's the first place that I put weight on. So it's like, oh, I just notice it right away, like in, on camera now. And it's driving me crazy and I'm so mad at myself for letting myself put on weight. Not that I put on like tons of weight, but you can see it in my face. My cheeks are much fuller. You just, it's just noticeable and it's bugging me. But anyways, okay, I'm going to go in with Royal um, Richie Purple, and this is from the limited edition 24K palette that we have for our lip, and we have a the 24K palette um, eyeshadow palette, and then we did three limited edition lip uh, lipsticks. This was the purple one. We have a red one in a, like a peachy color. So I'm going to use the purple one, and this is where it's going to get really bold. But it is gorgeous, guys. Oh, my God. Let me see if I have... Do I have a purple? I'm going to just put a little bit... of lip liner. This one is 225. Just to have it there to keep us in check. So, Richie, uh, Richie Purple, and this has like a gold undertone to it. It's super pretty, guys. But very bold. It's so weird. I can put on a liquid lipstick so much better than I can put on a regular lipstick. And I don't know why. I have no idea why. I have a harder time doing a regular lipstick. It's crazy. It's like I can tell it's crooked. It's going to drive me crazy. I mean, I know it's not my lips that are crooked. <laughs> I don't have crooked lips. <laughs> Guys, look at that. Is that not gorgeous? I mean, come on. That is a beautiful, beautiful purple. So again, Richie Purple. Part of the 24K Limited Edition box set. You get three lipsticks. Red, purple, and like I said, like a peachy color. And guys... Do I need to say any more about this? Like, what else is there to say? It is so beautiful. I love, love, love this look. I've worn it a couple of times now. It's just so beautiful. And if you didn't want to keep the really rich purple, you could go in with a matte liquid lip in a softer tone, or you could go in with Brave or Confident. Um... Or you could use a totally different product if you wanted to, if you have a favorite lip product that you like to wear. Um, but guys, is this not just, it's just stunning. I love it, love it, love it. And it is bold. It's definitely bold, but 
I don't think, I mean, I think anyone could rock this, really. I really do. I think anybody could use this lipstick, and I think it would look amazing on darker skin tones. Oh, my God, that would look beautiful. Um, so, yeah. So, that's the look, guys. So, again, we used VFX Camera Ready Foundation in 04. We set our eyes with 01 Cool Light in our pressed powder. We used the Wonderlust palette for our eyes, this one. And we used um, Base underneath the brow bone. We used Divine and we used Cupcake. Those are the three colors we used. We used our Vegan Green Mascara. And then we used the purple for our lips. And we used um, a blush that's retired, so I'm not even going to say the number. And then I used um, Terracotta Blush um, Terracotta Blush in the shade 05 for our highlight. And look at that. Look at that highlight. Can you see that? Is that not gorgeous? Oh, my God. So pretty. And we used Strobe Primer. I forgot to tell you. Strobe Primer, my favorite primer. I love that primer. It's the one I use the majority of the time. I, I do use the mattifying one, but Strobe is pretty much the one that I use all the time. So I am going to take a couple of pictures. I'm going to post this video and the pictures along with what I used all the details. Um, again, guys, don't forget we have new additions to the Age Reversed line. So if you are using that, we have three new products that you can add to your um, skincare regimen. We have the All Night Beauty Mask, the Tonic, and the Exfoliating Cleanser. We have the Lumi Radiance line. We have brand new hand creams. And guys, they smell amazing and they keep your hands so soft. They are so good. We have new perfume, new cologne. Um, we have a bunch of new stuff, guys. So go check it out. See if you find anything there that you want or like. And as always, you can message me if you have any questions. And as always, you can find all of these products at www.pharmacyus.com forward slash Charlotte Cardoso 2. And um, yeah, so have fun shopping. Have a great evening. And if you have tomorrow off, I hope that you enjoy it. I hope you have a really great day. And um, I'll be back the coming this coming week with some lives, maybe one pre-recorded. And I'll be posting some stuff up on the page. So keep me um, to keep you posted on any of the new things. We did sell out our, our Valentine's Day gift set. We sold out in four hours, but I did get one. So um, I was going to use it in a tutorial, but if you guys can't get it, there's probably no sense in doing that. But um, I am actually coming up with some of my own bundles to give you guys ideas um, for Valentine's Day. And because we all know how the post office has been lately, it's been a little crazy, a little slow. So I would suggest if you are looking to order anything for someone for Valentine's Day that you do so pretty soon so that you can be assured that it will get to you in time. Um, so I am going to post some bundles and some bundle suggestions and ideas on my Facebook page for you guys to kind of help you not have to be searching on the website. You can go right in and if you like the bundle I post, I'm going to post all the information and you can just go on and type it in, bring it up, boom, add it to your cart and you'll be all set. All right, guys, thank you so much for sharing a little bit of your time with me. As always, if you like me, if you like my content, if you could share, like, love the post, um, tell your friends and family, I'd appreciate it so much. It means so much and it helps me out so much. So thank you so much. Have a great rest of your evening. I'll be back, um, maybe not tomorrow, but Tuesday. All right, guys, thanks. Bye.